Well, if you have a little too much fun tonight, maybe if you have a drink too much. <laughs> How you feeling? <laughs> How are you feeling? <laughs> you might not feel so great tomorrow morning. So we're doing a little research this morning to figure out fact from fiction yes. on what actually will help a hangover for tomorrow morning. Okay, first, the cynic in me is going to say, really, if you've overindulged, you're, you're going to be just having to, you work it off tomorrow. Yeah, is that's what you're going to have to gonna, do. You're going to go to work and go, oh my <laughs> God, just quiet. However. So, an aspirin actually, right there is good for you. Is this fact? This one is fact. This it's is fact. actually better now, for you. Now, let's explain because we're not talking about your Tylenols here. No, in fact, there's a difference between the aspirin, the acetaminophen, and the um, ibuprofen. The ibuprofen and the aspirin are better for you because they don't interact with your liver the same way that the um, And goodness knows that liver's been through does. enough. That right? Yes. So, yeah, so <laughs> don't, don't go with that. Go with the aspirin and plenty of water. Now, they were also talking about the Bloody Mary. Is this a You know, a lot, of folks, a lot of folks do this, where you, and we don't have, we're not going to put the vodka in it, so that actually makes this a little different. We need some, some Who juice. Who makes a Bloody Mary in a mason jar? Well, uh, that's what we had. <laughs> that's, that's what we had. Here's the Oh, you are not making Bloody Marys at my house. No, house. yeah. So anyway, if you, make, if you make the Bloody Marys, if you put the, the alcohol in it, that whole hair of the dog thing, yeah. that's a diuretic. You're already dehydrated, so it actually doesn't help you. So you're just kind of prolonging what's going to be even a worse? Even worse, because you're just adding to it at that point. So, yeah, the, the Bloody Mary may taste good, and it may sort of keep things going for you, okay. but it's not actually going to be helpful for you. Tell me more, oh wise one. What about the strong cup of coffee? <laughs> strong cup of yes coffee? Yes no? I, I think the caffeine helps. The caffeine actually may help perk you up, Okay. but it turns out it's also a diuretic. So what happens so I'm is I'm dehydrated even more. It dehydrates you even more. So this one is fiction too. Oh, and here are oh, the wait. folks who are going to need this. Our one. happy party girls are back. Here's, here's for the coffee. Some here's coffee for the coffee. For you. Okay. Yeah. The coffee is actually going to dehydrate you even wow. more how, because how it's a diuretic. It? It smells so, like shoes, but you'll be right. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> it smells like shoes. Okay. Uh, so that no, one no, is it does. The, oh. Cheers. Oh, okay. So, so I'm not that, sure one is, that. that one is fiction. Okay. What about the greasy breakfast? You've done yes, this, right? I say greasy all the way. It turns out this one is partly fact because okay. when we when we drink so much at night that it begins to irritate the lining of your stomach, a greasy breakfast will actually help coat your stomach a little bit. Okay. And it will help. It might even soak up a little bit that's left over. <laughs> well, that's always good. So to know. it's partly fact for that if one. If you can get it down. Yeah, yeah. It, that's, that's problem. the other hard part is you got to be able to actually get it down. But, you know, the number one thing that the doctors say. What, Dr. Oz? You're ready for this? Yes. Water. Good old water. Good old Just fashion. do that. The fact of the matter is, is you're, you're, you're dehydrated. So you need some water to get rehydrated again. And the hospital folks tell us that if this is their first line of treatment is they'll give you a glass of water. If you go to the hospital. If you are that hungover, you need to go to the hospital. you got other issues. Well, and so they, they, <laughs> they're they're they, they, exactly. they start with that, and then they give you an IV to sort of get right. that saline moving, so it, it actually helps. But the best thing you can do is sleep it off. Sleep it off. Just sleep and it off. drink a lot of this throughout the night. Uh, as much as you can. Okay. As much as you can. Can I take this with me? Thank Absolutely. You. Thank you very much. <laughs> can Thank I have you. that? Party girls, you Here guys, you, go. you need that I'm, I'm going to give I you that. <laughs> both. And you notice they aren't giving back their dresses to Macy's mm -hmm. yet. No, no, no this is those. fun. I've got to go somewhere tonight. I'm taking it. Oh, we have a better way for you to rock your New Year's Eve. How about a, a giveaway? Like in this part, a uh -huh. pair of tickets to give away for the Broadway show, We Will Rock You. It's Queen. We're going to give those up for grabs when we come back.